Hi Scorpio, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another Love Bite. So Scorpio, let's see what's the message here for you today. And a warm welcome back to all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. Scorpio Spirit, judgment in reverse. Ooh. Okay. Somebody is moving towards new love or maybe self-love. It's like, yeah, I don't want to give this a second chance. Things are stuck here. Um, maybe there's no communication between the two of you. Yep, somebody is angry. Somebody is angry here and saying, you know what? I've thought long and hard about this. I'm going to go after my own happiness now. So, well, I could be wrong. Of course, I'm going to clarify all these cards for you, Scorpio. Uh, but first, let's start with some dialogue message cards. Uh, let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be, and then we'll clarify these. This could also be the other person feeling that they're not going to get a second chance because their person seems to be maybe moving on or something. So, Scorpio and that person's spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Scorpio and that person's spirit. Okay, let's take a few more from another deck. Scorpio and their person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Scorpio and their person. Okay, just a few more from a third deck as well. Scorpio and then we'll start the reading. Scorpio and their person. All right, got them all. Let's start the reading, Scorpio. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is omkarataro at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. So the first card here says, I know you feel the same way. If you didn't, why would you keep in touch and get triggered when I say left next lifetime? I want us to be able to talk through things properly. The only problem is in your presence. All I seem to have is wild thoughts about what I want to do to you. I just want to see you again and begin our life together. But these financial challenges are currently stopping us from being together. Who would have thought that something as simple as money could keep people who love each other this much apart? I want to protect you, steal your smiles, stop your tears and wake up to kiss you every morning. I want to show you that you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. I didn't run away from you, I ran away from myself. It's all deep down to my deep fear of rejection and insecurities. No matter how complicated this gets, I won't ever give up on you or us. A part of me died when I let you go. My heart was blocked. I was not available to receive your love when you gave it. I missed out on something so good. The next person you allow into your life is lucky. Hurting you was not the plan. I'm still healing. Alright, so Scorpio, these were some of your messages. If these were resonating with your storyline, let's start this reading with an angel blessing card. Let's see what my angels want to bless um, the viewer. Uh, blessing, guidance, advice or a message for the person who's drawn to this reading today. Uh, so Scorpio, this could be you, could be the cross watcher. And um, sometimes these uh, love bites, the energy gets flipped. So I could be picking up on your cross watcher's energy as well, right? So, well, the message for, your, for the viewer here is child. Either something to do with the child or this actually represents just a brand new beginning. And that's what I see in the middle of my spread as well. Somebody going into, you know, new love or self-love or a new beginning which, which is emotionally happy for them. So this is like a fresh brand new start. So Spirit, tell me now what's going on. Uh, I have a feeling this is, uh, this is from the perspective of the person who feels they have lost their chance. Uh, judgment in reverse, Spirit. 
Yeah, somebody feels they, they are, yeah, see that person is not talking to them. Now they are scared. They may not get a second chance. It's over. They feel judged. They feel they're getting some bad karma or say things have stopped, you know, working in their favor. They're feeling blocked. Yeah, they're feeling blocked and I have the Wheel of Fortune again twice. So twice, Wheel of Fortune, Wheel of Fortune. I mean twice and both times in reverse because they feel that person is walking away from them ending things with them, stopping things from them, um, emotionally leaving them behind or something. Uh, I think they, there is a lot of love that they feel for that person though and they do want to open up but right now they are very angry. <laughs> They're angry that that, that that person is releasing them. Uh, they feel this is my person, we are supposed to be together, we are soulmates, but now maybe some bad memories have been created between the two of you. So they're very scared that this, this soulmate contract is coming to an end and that person is, you know, got their confidence back and is probably moving on. And that is not making this other person happy, the person who feels they won't get a second chance. Uh, eight of Wands in Reverse, Spirit. Eight of Wands in Reverse. I guess there is a lack of communication between the two of you. Uh, somebody here was trying to get away with something, but now they feel what was the point? What was the point of playing all those mind games that I was playing? Because now they feel like the loser because something has been, something has come out in the open. Maybe that person got to know you know what they were playing at or something but they feel oh my god why was i doing what i was doing i don't know what they were doing they were either lying or cheating or ghosting or something and the person just stopped talking to them and said you know what i'm done here i have to cut this connection off i mean this is just too much trouble here uh, this this sense that that person is now totally moving on towards a emotionally happy new beginning for themselves uh, Ace of Cups, Ace of Cups, yeah, yeah, given up on them, totally given up on them, uh, maybe getting victory in their own life and not choosing them back or something. It's making this person who's feeling left behind very, very stressed out. They're feeling stressed out, they feel, uh, you know, uh, they're overthinking, they're doing their question answers in their own mind, feeling trapped, feeling blinded basically feeling overwhelmed that oh my god oh my god look at all the cards i mean nightmares sleepless nights stress tension because they feel that the person who's moving on is their perfect match even though i've never told them i mean they should know that i love them kind of a thing because right now uh, the thought of their person moving forward is making them feel left behind they're feeling left behind feeling <clears throat> left out in the cold they are um, they feel they've lost their power right I, th I think this person was a very stubborn character who thought that things are always going to be the way they are and things are fine but right now they could be sitting in heartbreak they could be sitting in heartbreak recognizing that you know uh, I want this person back in my life. They were so loving, they were so kind, they were so nurturing, they were so giving. And uh, maybe this person is now wishing, praying, hoping, you know, that uh, that person doesn't leave them. Uh, but they don't see the other person really chasing them. Maybe, uh, yeah, they f no, forget chasing. They feel that the other person is totally in their power totally in their power and attracting beautiful things into their life has turned their back on them and uh, yes is moving on towards self-love and new love for themselves somewhere they feel that uh, their person is uh, very upset and angry with them as well right queen of wands in reverse queen of wands in reverse yeah they feel that they did something in the past which was which made the other person angry and now they are seen as a toxic person or something and now my, now their person doesn't want to reunite with them, will not accept an apology from them and has uh, released them as uh, somebody who was bad for them or toxic for them or something. Uh, whoever this individual is, if they are sitting in a lot of sadness, a lot of regret, feeling shame and guilt and remorse because they are sensing that the other person is shutting the door on them and has is totally guarded, taking their power back. So, well, we come back to, I think, this King of Cups who is now overwhelmed and not very happy, not happy at all, actually. They're not happy at all with that. 
they're not happy because they feel that the other person has regained their confidence. It's like, look at them shining bright and attracting attention and chasing their dreams and, um, I'm, I, you know, they don't need me anymore or they don't want me anymore, something like that. So, yeah, there is a, a feeling that something is shutting down so that, you know, something new can begin. Uh, world card spirit, overall energy. Oops, I dropped a card. One second, give me a second. Yeah. Uh, temperance one one more please for the world card yep somebody feels that they are busy healing their own self and going off for a very peaceful happy brand new beginning for themselves it's making the other person feel feel a little angry and jealous I, I, I won't uh, deny that because the knight of wands is here in reverse but they are angry they are jealous because and they're depressed a little bit as well that's what I have for you. Till next time then, love and light. Take care. Namaste, Scorpio.